There are over 2,000 hockey rinks in the United States. Every hockey player is different. Some love the large multiple ice sheet rinks with restaurants, indoor training facilities, event spaces, and expansive sports shops. Others enjoy the simpler, kind of old school designs. I'll personally never forget the meat locker in Tacoma, Washington. It was blue collar and proud of it. Tucked in the center of a rundown industrial area of the city, you would enter and walk through a literal meat refrigerator with heavy clear plastic strips to enter the rink area. It was frigid cold with super low ceilings, but it was some of the best ice around. You either loved it or you hated it. Yelp reviews to this day either give it either a one star or five star. There's never anything between. But that's just it when it comes to ice rinks. What rinks do you associate your love of hockey with? For this list, we focused on hockey rinks used for youth hockey only. We did not include NHL or college ice rinks unless they had youth hockey teams who call that rink their home. So enjoy our list of the top 10 youth hockey rinks in the United States. The Super Rink at National Sports Center is a 300,000 square foot ice rink facility that features eight sheets of ice and is the largest ice rink arena complex in the world. It is located on the National Sports Center campus in Blaine, Minnesota. The Super Rink hosts a number of ice sport events year round, including ice hockey, speed skating, figure skating, broom ball, recreational ice skating, and off ice training at the Herb Brooks Training Center. The Super Rink is home to various youth, high school, and adult ice hockey teams and is also home to the U.S. Women's National Hockey Team and the Bethel University Royals men's and women's ice hockey teams competing at the NCAA Division III level in the Minnesota Intercollegiate Athletic Conference. The Herb Brooks Training Center is a state-of-the-art hockey training center that was part of the Super Rink expansion that occurred in 2006. The Herb Brooks Training Center was created to improve the game of hockey through proper player development via off-ice and on-ice skills training protocols. The facility has many off-ice hockey-specific training stations, including a skating treadmill. The Herb Brooks Training Center is run and operated by the Flex Hockey Institute of Training, or FIT. FIT offers memberships to the Herb Brooks Training Center and year-round training programs. The Flyers Skate Zones were established to increase the opportunities for people in the greater Philadelphia region to experience the sports of ice skating and hockey in a fun, safe, and comfortable environment. You will find Skate Zone rinks in Northeast Philly, Atlantic City, Pensacon, and Voorhees. The Voorhees location is the practice facility of the Philadelphia Flyers of the NHL. It is also home to the Virtua AAA Tier 1 team, one of the best youth hockey organizations in the country. The rink offers just about everything from public skating to birthday parties, learn to skate, summer camps, figure skating, adult learn to skate, clinics, leagues, and youth hockey clubs. The Gear Zone Sports Shop is packed with Philadelphia and Virtua apparel as well for all of your equipment. This is a staple of hockey in Philadelphia. Make sure you check out the Flyer Skate Zone in Borges. The New England Sports Center is a two-story, eight-rink ice skating facility located on 22.3 acres of suburban land. The 220,000 square foot building has over 65 locker rooms, a hockey pro shop, ice skate sharpening, ice skate rentals, function rooms, a full-service restaurant, and a snack bar. In addition to the eight full-size rink, the facility has an additional two miniature ice surfaces, rinks 9 and 10. Host to the Hayden Nets, home to the Skating Club of Boston Metro West, the Minuteman Flames, Central Massachusetts Outlaws, and the Junior Rowan's hockey team, the New England Sports Center is noteworthy for having more ice skating surfaces than any other arena in the New England area. Because the New England Sports Center has 10 ice surfaces, it has the ability to host larger organizations and has hosted events of national and international importance, as well as playing host to Olympic figure skating hopefuls and hockey players of all ages and abilities. If you have never been to the New England Sports Center in Marlboro, Massachusetts, now's the time to check it out. The USA Hockey Arena is a multi-purpose arena in Plymouth Township, Michigan, opened in 1996. Originally known as the CompuWare Sports Arena, it was renamed to USA Hockey Arena in 2015 when the USA Hockey Foundation purchased the arena. USA Hockey Arena encompasses approximately 170,000 square feet with one main seating level, private suites, and press boxes. The creative design of the arena affords the opportunity to provide 3,500 seats for hockey games and 4,500 seats for concerts and other performances. The USA Arena is also home to the CompuWare Hockey Club, one of the best hockey programs in Michigan. It is also home to the United States National Team Development Program, where the top players in the United States are chosen to represent their country in international play and also participate in the USHL schedules. 
The Ice Den in Scottsdale, Arizona is a gorgeous modern ice rink facility that is the home to the Arizona Junior Coyotes Hockey Organization. It is also the practice facility for the Arizona Coyotes of the NHL. It includes a Coyote Ice Sports, which is a full-service hockey and skating pro shop stocked with equipment and apparel from top brands. It has the Chili Bean Cafe, which is a full-service snacks and concession stand, and the 18 Degrees Neighborhood Grill, which serves breakfast, lunch, dinner, happy hour, late night, and carry out. So if you're looking for a cocktail, they've got you covered. Uh, the Mountainside Fitness Platinum Center, which is a 12,000 square foot gym and training facility, and the OSR Physical Therapy, which is on-site physical therapy and re rehabilitation services. The Ice Den is the hub of hockey in the state of Arizona. The state has seen an explosion of interest in hockey in the state following the great rise of Austin Matthews, who hailed from Arizona. If you want to see the next great hockey talent coming out of the state, take a trip out to the Ice Den in Scottsdale and catch a game or practice of the Junior Coyotes. And if you happen to be a Junior Coyotes player, you never know when the great stick handler himself, Pavel Barber, might just stop by. The Ice Den at Scottsdale is one of the most beautiful hockey facilities I've ever been to. If you get the chance to play a game or tournament or see some skills competitions or anything you can to get down to the Ice Den in Scottsdale, I highly recommend heading down south. One of the finest sports and recreational facilities in the country, located in Stamford, Connecticut, Chelsea Piers offers instructional programs, camps, sports leagues, competitive teams, fitness, and drop-in fun for children and adults. Chelsea Piers, Connecticut was developed and is managed by the same management team that built and currently manages the highly acclaimed Chelsea Piers Sports and Entertainment Complex in New York City. Like Chelsea Piers, New York, it is the mission to provide an unparalleled athletic environment that is always clean, safe, friendly, and fun. Chelsea Piers, Connecticut is the home ice of the Connecticut Junior Rangers, one of the best triple-A hockey teams of the East Coast. The Connecticut Whale of the National Women's Hockey League, or the NWHL, play their home games at Chelsea Pierce, Connecticut as well. This is an incredible facility with every sport you can imagine, all under one roof, and they house some of the most amazing hockey teams on the East Coast. Check it out. The Rinks Development Program launched in 2009 and now consists of eight local hockey and skating facilities throughout Southern California. Five ice rinks, the Rinks Anaheim Ice, the Rinks Lakewood Ice, the Rinks Westminster Ice, the Rinks Yorba Linda Ice, and the Rinks Poway Ice, as well as three inline facilities, the Rinks Corona Inline, the Rinks Huntington Beach Inline, and the Rinks Irvine Inline. The rinks offer a variety of hockey and skating programs for participants of all ages and ability levels and are home to thousands of youth and adult hockey players as well as recreational skaters to competitive Olympic figure skaters. Programs include daily public ice skating and roller skating sessions, youth and adult hockey programs and leagues, figure skating, learn to skate cap classes, curling, birthdays, and group events. The rinks Anaheim are home to both the Junior Ducks and Lady Duck hockey organizations that represent some of the best hockey in Southern California. From the Anaheim Ducks Learn to Play Hockey Program and the Little Ducks Program, designed for first-time skaters and players to get started in their hockey journey, to hockey initiation, in-house recreation leagues, camps, and travel hockey. The rinks have the program you are looking for to continue your child's skill development. The rinks are recognized as a model club association through USA Hockey and are dedicated to age-appropriate, age-specific skill development in accordance with USA Hockey's American Development Model. If you haven't had a chance to check out the rinks in Anaheim, I highly recommend you do it and check out some of the best youth players available. Little Caesars Arena in the District Detroit serves as the home of the Detroit Red Wings, Detroit Pistons, and countless other sports, entertainment, and community services. The arena features state-of-the-art technology, fan amenities, and active community spaces like the VIA, the Belfort Training Center, and the Chevrolet Plaza. The Belfort Training Center, the practice rink of the Detroit Red Wings, is the home of the Little Caesars Hockey Club, with world-class amenities available to all Little Caesars AAA hockey players. The major goal of the Little Caesars Hockey is to develop well-rounded student athletes, both on and off the ice, through instruction, discipline, and positive feedback provided by outstanding coaches. What's fun about the Belfort Training Center is that it's below the main rink in the Little Caesars Arena. So the NHL team could be playing up top and the Little Caesars folks or other youth teams could be playing in the Belfort Training Ice right below them. So make sure and check out the Little Caesars Arena in Detroit, Michigan next time you've got a chance. It's pretty amazing. Solar for America Ice at San Jose is located at 1500 South 10th Street in San Jose, California. 
It is the largest rink facility west of the Mississippi and is one of only seven rink facilities in the United States that currently operates at least four NHL-sized ice rinks. The nearly 170,000 square feet facility accommodates ice hockey, figure skating, broomball, curling, speed skating, ice dancing, as well as public skating. Solar for America Ice is the official practice facility of the NHL's San Jose Sharks. Solar for America Ice is also home to the Junior Sharks organization, a member of the Tier 1 Elite Hockey League. Solar for America Ice at San Jose, along with Solar for America Ice at Fremont, currently holds the largest number of adult USA hockey participants of any facility in the nation. They feature an in-house pro shop, large meeting and party spaces, as well as Stanley's Sports Bar, a full-service restaurant and bar that overlooks three of the rinks. This is my favorite dining facility of any hockey rink in the United States. I've loved being able to watch both my 98 and 06 Junior Sarks players on different rinks from Stanley's with a beer in my hand. Great memories, great staff, great rink. The UPMC Lemieux Sports Complex is the primary practice and training facility for the Pittsburgh Penguins, as well as a comprehensive outpatient facility for UPMC Sports Medicine. The first of its kind facility in the Pittsburgh region is a true partnership between two world-class organizations. The facility is dedicated to treating, training, and inspiring athletes at every level. The multi-use facility is a destination for athletes of all ages and skill levels seeking sports medicine performance and rehabilitation expertise as well as hockey specific skills and performance training. The UPMC Lemieux Sports Complex will feature 185,000 square feet of total space, 54,000 square feet of clinical space, sports medicine clinic with 24 private patient rooms, a physical therapy gym overlooking the Penguins practice rink, aquatic therapy, on-site MRI and x-ray imaging, two full-size hockey rinks with approximately 1,500 total seats, 14 locker rooms, and a dedicated sports performance space including a sprinting track and batting cages. The Excel Hockey Academy is a partnership between North Catholic High School and the UPMC Lemieux Sports Complex, and the Academy provides a superior academic program coupled with on-ice and off-ice training. UPMC Lemieux Sports Complex is also the home of the Penguins Elite. Pittsburgh Penguins Elite is Western Pennsylvania's premier AAA amateur hockey organization. A joint effort of the NHL's Pittsburgh Penguins and corporate partner Dick Sporting Goods, Pittsburgh Penguins Elite offers a comprehensive program for player development that includes the region's premier coaching staff, professional management, world-class training facilities, and unique opportunities along with proven academic and career guidance. The Penguins Elite program is the only program in the region that offers a full complement of teams for boys and girls at all age groups. This facility is incredible and breathtaking. If you have never visited, I highly recommend you check out the UPMC Lemieux Sports Complex. So that concludes our list of the top 10 hockey rinks in the United States. Do we miss your favorite hockey rink in our list? Leave a comment and let us know your favorite hockey rink. Thanks for stopping by, and we'll see you on the ice. Oh,